G-Hub thing, whatever it's called. Hopefully that fixes it. Uh, I don't know, but I mean, hopefully. Actually, let's go to the vault. Let's check out the vault. I don't know how much I have in here, but there might be a bit. How many vault crates do we get today? I'm not guessing too many, but maybe like three or four. So I did uninstall the Logitech thingy. I'm thinking that maybe that driver was causing the mouse to use up a little bit too much power so that the microphone wasn't able to pick it up. I'm thinking that might be the case. I can't I can't think of anything else because that's all I've done is install that. Like I haven't changed anything else on my computer besides that and the, the, the disk space that I've deleted. So at this point, my computer should be back to, to the state it was last time I recorded. Um, but, I mean, I don't know. I'm not getting any more of these. I had 50. You can only have up to 50? I had, I've had 50 for a while now. That's concerning. Uh, anyway, we gotta do Endless Hard Wave 15. 75,000 dosh through kills, rewards, and healing on Desolation Total. That one's gonna come naturally as we do this. This is not hard, but we're gonna go through a little bit of Endless Hard Desolation. I know that we could do Endless Hell on Earth, but just to give myself the best possible chance of success here, I'm gonna put it to Hard, because I don't really wanna fail. Also, I wanna play Commando right now, um, but we've got to play out with the new DLC weapons. Yeah, that's just... That's how content works, right? And I have no idea what ended up getting recorded in the last one. And what didn't. I have I have absolutely just no clue. Uh, so I'm, I'm hoping that my commentary was at least mostly... Um, somewhat... Coherent. Even with the microphone cutting out. But I have I have no idea. Really. Hey, did you notice that uh, that spin there? And <laughs> my uh, my DPI is a little bit different than what I'm used to with uh, with having removed the Logitech G Hub. I didn't mean to get a full 180 there. So I'm continuing to check the microphone audio, and it's still picking it up, which is good. I'm I'm really hoping that that was the case. I'm I'm just if that was what it is, then you know what, that's fine. Um, and if that is what it is, then I think what I have to do is get a new, uh, or another extension, just for my microphone. Uh, cause I have my keyboard, my mouse, and my mic all running off of the same single USB port on my computer. So they're all getting, like, the power from just the one. Uh, so, you know, it, it could be a little bit too much, and, uh, the microphone's the one that just ends up going. Which is fine, I guess. Um, I don't know. It's, it's upsetting, but I mean, if that's how it works, then that's how it works, right? I want to get a new microphone anyway, because my current microphone is... You know, my, my audio quality is fine in these videos. It's not... like It's probably better than what you'd expect of, of somebody who's just starting out on YouTube. Um, but it's not as good as, like, exceptional. You know, it's not exceptional. And I do want to have exceptional audio, because it's kind of a plug-and-forget-it thing, right? Like, once you have it set up, you're done. Right? There's no more work. You just... you have exceptional audio. Once once you have your... your sound... reflecting... foam stuff put up, and... all this other stuff, I mean... you're done. You don't have to, you don't have to, you don't have to do it again. Unless it falls down, but... just put it up properly. You know? No big deal, you. Oh man, this DPI is really bad. Uh, what, what DPI do I like? I like this DPI. It's a little bit fast, but when it is seem doable. I'm just gonna have to like re get used to it, but I think I like this more. I like a little bit higher. I'm not a professional game. I mean, I guess I'm striving to be one, <laughs> technically, but I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not playing CS:GO or anything like that. Nah, it's just too high. I want in between here and here. Okay, I want just in between there, and I just I can't get it. 
I don't have it built into my mouse. I've just, I've been getting too used to that specific DPI that I had with the G-Hub. And, uh, I just, I don't get that anymore, so I'll, have to, I'll just have to get used to it. It's fine. It's not a big deal. Oh, uh, there's a few stories I want to tell you about, but I'm not sure if the people involved want to, want me to tell you them. And I can't think of a way to, to tell them without revealing at least something about them. Oh my god, this DPI is just... Horrible. I can't do flick shots with this at all. I don't have like a big desk space, right? I mean, I have a decently large desk, but not a lot of desk space for my mouse to be on. That went through your head. Don't even. Oh, this DPI is so bad. I mean, I'll get used to it, but... So it's going to be a bit, and there's going to be some planning. So yeah, there's a few stories that I want to tell you about. Because there's something just that I just find to be hilariously funny that happened the other day. But it's involving a topic that I'm not sure they'd want me to talk about. Um, so I'm just going to have to avoid it. And that's kind of like a thing that happens often. Is something happens with, with me and, and a friend or something. And, uh, oh, come on. Come on. And I'm like, all right, this would make like for a great video. I could talk about this for 15 minutes, no problem. But then, are they okay with that? You know, it's, that's that's the other thing I have to kind of worry about is because I know that they they'd largely be most most of the people who I talk to would largely be okay with me talking privately with with friends, family, whatever about you know whatever's happening. But um, once once you go onto a video and you put it out publicly and you know, for everybody to see, it's it's a different thing, right? Like, I don't know if uh, if people are comfortable with me talking about that. And then I'm also like, do I ask? You know, do I do I do I message them and be like, hey, you okay with me talking about this thing on video? I mean, I guess like I could, but then I don't know. I can also just think of other topics to talk about, like, for instance, the fact that I can't talk about these things. So I generally just try to avoid topics that involve other people. Even though I really do want to talk some some smack about this this one very special individual who uh, that's about the density of a, a neutron star. <laughs> I uh, would love to talk about it, but it's not a weight joke, by the way. It's uh, just a lot of things going over their head, and uh, I'd like to talk about the specifics of it, but. And it's like, I'm the kind of person who, you know, when somebody posts a picture of their girlfriend, I'm like, hey, whoa, is, is, has your girlfriend explicitly said that you can do this? They're like, well, like, I know she doesn't mind. I'm like, but did she say you can do it? <laughs> so, really, it's not, it's not, it's nothing major. And people who see it are probably going to be like, for the most part, like, you're just, you're freaking out about nothing. But to me... It's, it's important to, to take into account other people's feelings, right? Even about m mundane things. I mean, largely because I've had a lot of troubles with that kind of stuff in the past, just by nature of not being able to, to really understand it properly. I need it to be laid out very obviously and plainly for me to, to be able to actually understand it. Um, just because I don't really pick up on like social cues and all that. Oh, hello. You're dying, like, immediately, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> I was a little bit concerned about tanking that, that rocket. A little a little concerned about tanking that rocket shot, but I figured, you know, should be able to. It's only hard at that point. Should be able to tank. Yeah, so right here, it's not breaking it. it takes two shots. My god. That's incredible. We're gonna upgrade these because uh, we can, and we don't really need the ammunition. The deagles are a good weapon. And I don't think anybody's debating the deagles is a is a good weapon. Anyway, yeah, I, I, I'm I'm super super picky about privacy. Um, so it could be, you know, like I was talking with somebody the other day, and 
They said they don't like Killing Floor. I'm like, am I allowed to talk about this? <laughs> like, are you okay with me talking about this on on camera? Because to me, it's just I don't know. I'd rather I'd rather know, and then um, do it. Like, I'd rather I'd rather know that they're okay with it, than uh, than do it and then find out that they're not okay with it. Because I, mean, I don't know. For me, I'd I'd. Uh, I mean, I'm sure there are things that are that are seeming mon seemingly mundane to other people that I would prefer to not have people talk about publicly. You know, I can't think of any because to me they're not mundane, but to other people they they might be mundane. Like, um, I don't know. Like, like yeah. Like if I were to be, you know, if uh, if I had a boyfriend and and they were posting a picture of me, I'd want them to ask if I was okay with it first. You know, or if I was in a recording or something, I'd want I'd want them to ask if I was okay with it before they posted it. And to other people, that might seem mundane, but to me, it's just. I mean, I think you should always ask before you post pictures of somebody. But I guess in the case of you're dating, then you kind of should know if they're okay with it. But I don't know. It's just hard to talk about things because a lot of what happens in my life is involving other people, and I'm like, I can't really. I can't really talk about it, because I don't know if they want me to. I like this map a lot. They uh, they did make some changes that I'm not in favor of. Like, they made it a lot more crowded. They added a lot more corner spawns. Um, but the brightness of it, I'm actually, I'm into it. I don't like the super dark maps. This map was super dark before, too. It was really, really dark. And uh, for me, it's just... I like, I like having visibility. I value being able to see. You know, some people value that... Um, uh, like, eerie, creepy kind of feeling. To me, that's not something that I care about. I don't, I don't care for that at all. In fact, the less eerie and the less creepy something can be, the more I'll enjoy it. Because I'm kind of really bad at being... Like, I'm, I'm, I'm really... I'm really good at being scared, if you know what I mean. I get scared, and then I get super scared. So, like, Killing Floor 1, I wasn't actually able to play it by myself very often. I'd usually just get to the boss and then give up, because um, I was, I would, I'd be too scared by the Patriarch. I didn't know where he was, and I was like, oh no, he's gonna get me. Where is he? And then he'd jump around a corner, and I'd, like, scream. Killing Floor 2, it doesn't happen as much, because uh, they have a lot more audio cues. But um, in Killing for 1, it definitely happened. So to me, it's like, I don't want scary maps. I want not scary maps, you know? That's what I want. Microphone is still working. This is fantastic news. I'm thinking it might have been the G-Hub thing. Maybe the G-Hub thing and the disk space combined was, for some reason, making it completely brick. But I saw a stalker. Okay, I saw a raindrop. Not they they they're very similar things. Stalkers, raindrops. Um, you you know you could see how one could easily get them mixed up. I hate these new text the the new models for these guys just suck. The Scrakes especially, I hate them. Do the Gorfiends have this like weird knife thing that sometimes blocks shots on their face? Mm. I have this weird feeling in the the right half of my face right now. I think it's from smiling too much. I smile a lot when I record. Yeah, it's not like I'm losing feelings. I can still feel stuff, but... It's probably, uh... Probably from smiling too much. Is my guess. It's a weird feeling, though. Very, very weird. Unwelcomed feeling. I just ate uh, some lunch, too, so my jaw was already kind of... in. I had some leftover chicken from last night. Like, we had a... Uh, we had chicken salad, not like, you, know, you, you have like chicken salad, and then you have salad with chicken, right? We had salad with chicken, a um, little Caesar salad thing, and uh, it was good, uh, but the chicken was super dry. That was yesterday, right? That was yesterday when it was just made. So I had some, uh, I had like a, a tiny little chicken breast today for lunch with, um, 
Wait, did I have anything else? I don't think I had anything else. I wanted to have some pineapple, but it was in the fridge and like super cold. And I just, I didn't, I don't want to deal with it right now. Um, but I had that and it was super dry, so uh, a lot of chewing. So I'm guessing my jaw was already kind of sore from that. And then I come over here and I'm talking and laughing and smiling. And uh, it's kind of making my jaw even more sore. Which is fine, because I've got, I've got, you know, another 14 episodes to record today after this one. Not, not like I have uh, anything else to worry about, right? <laughs> what I don't do for you guys. Good old water. People drink weird things. Like coffee. You know who made who made coffee the first time? There's so many there's so many things like this. It's just like how did you guys ever find out that this would be good? <laughs> you know? I just I don't get it. Coffee's one of them. You guys you guys people people find these beans. Right, you find these little beans out in the wild. You're like, oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to leave them out in the sun, make them super dry, then I'm gonna mash them up and soak them in water, and then I'm gonna drink the water. And it's like, how do you how do you get to that point? I guess they're making like tea, you know. But again, how do you get to the point where you're making tea? I guess that kind of makes sense. Like you have water, and you're like. Man, I wonder if I put leaves in it. Does it taste better? Okay, I, I can kind of see how coffee comes to be. You know, you start off with tea. You know, you put some some leaves in a, in a cup of water to, to make it taste a little bit better. That makes sense. And then you have coffee beans, and you, you stick them in there. And then for preservation's sake, you start to dry them. And then when they're dry, you're like, I guess we can turn it into a powder to save some space. And then now you have coffee. In its, uh, in its modern form. I guess, I guess that makes some semblance of sense. I mean, I still think it's weird. Like, the first time anybody ever had, like, blue cheese. And then, you know, going forward from that, okay, sure. I can see somebody having seen some rotten cheese and being like, yeah, like, I'm hungry, and this is probably gonna poison me, but, like, I'm really hungry, and I'm gonna die anyway. May as well, may as well eat some, some of this bad cheese just to make me less hungry. And that person's like, you know, that actually tastes pretty good. How do you, how do you go to other people, right? How do you, how do you go from one person trying it to, you know what? Everybody should be eating this. <laughs> Like, you, you have the one person who eats it, and he goes up to his friends, and he's like, Yo! I found this <laughs> this rotting cheese. Y'all should eat it. <laughs> like, who, who, who would do that? If, if somebody brought me food, and it was, like, moldy, and, and, and visibly, like, bad. Ain't no way I'm eating that! <laughs> No way! Like, you bring me, like, a pork chop that's just got this, like, green mold growing on it. I mean, it's not really green, but you got this, like, pork chop that's, like, moldy, and this person's like, yeah, it's pretty good. I guess that's what dry age is. I, I guess that is literally what dry age is. That, that is what dry age is. Okay. Point taken. Point taken. But, you know, that's, that's, again, that, that's, that's already done. People already know that dry-aged meat is, is fine. But if you brought, I, I'm trying to think of something that I wouldn't eat, but, like, we've already done it all. Why have we done this? Why do we eat rotting food? I'm, 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 think, I'm thinking, like, okay, what about, like, grapes? No, that's raisins. Okay, what about anything else? It's just dried fruit or whatever, right? And I'm like, I don't know why we're doing this kind of stuff. And most of it happened way back in the past. When people didn't really have the same kind of uh, standards for health. And uh, in modern... Hello? Where are you, Hans? Why are you way over there? Where are you going? What are you doing? 
What are you doing? I am so confused right now. Why is he... Does he not know that he can come in here too? Like, I feel like he doesn't understand that this is... You know, it's like a carpool lane, but... You got multiple people there. You can come in too. Why was he- why was he not chasing me? That was bizarre. Is that like a weird AI thing that when you're over here they path a different way? It might be. It could- it could potentially be. It's very strange though. Where are we going? We're going this way. Very, very strange indeed. I think that was a suicidal boss. That was a pathetic cons fight, I'll tell you that much. We're at 21 minutes now. Microphone still hasn't died. I'm thinking I'm a genius. And by removing all the things that I've changed since it broke, which is something that only I could think of, it's fixed it. So I think that it was, I'm thinking it was probably the power consumption of the Logitech mouse going up because of the drivers, which are causing it to do, I don't know, some like polling or something, maybe. Um, Let's go for the golds. Thinking it was maybe some polling issues. You know, so when you have uh, when you have your your Logitech mouse with the with the the software in it as well, the mouse has to like communicate with the software and like have this back and forth and that little bit of extra power from from that little bit of processing just used up the 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 power that's in the in the extension that I have. That's my guess. And I'm sticking to it. Okay. I mean, it's pretty sound. Pretty sound theory. Ah, uh, we're going to be doing an endless... This is a bad idea. I'm doing an endless run, and I don't know if I'm going to stop. Like, we're going to go until... I mean, I die, basically. Um, but we are, uh, I'm going to go until I die or until we reach like, I don't know, an hour and a half, two hours or something like that. Um, but I guess I upgraded the decals, so we may as well use them, right? But I also have to record two extra episodes today because of the, uh, the changing the recording day. So it's like going to be a really long recording day for me today. I was talking about him in, uh, in a previous episode, but uh, one of the viewers who uh, who claims to be my best friend, but I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't rank him that highly, you know. Maybe, maybe, maybe good friend. Hello. <laughs> he, uh, he wanted to, to show up in one of the videos. He wanted to play with me earlier, I guess. Um, be a, have a cameo. And... Uh, I guess, I guess you're going to find out exactly how long it takes me to do a recording session now, because you'll find out when I started and when I ended. That'll be good for you. If you care about that. I don't know if you do. But it takes so long, because you have, uh... Obviously, the, the actual games to record, right? So, you know, about 20 minutes a match, maybe 15 minutes when I'm on Hell on Earth now. Um, about 15 minutes a match, and hello, you have 14 of those. You know, you can you can do the math there. That's 140, 210, like three and a half hours of of just playing the game. But then you also have all that in between stuff, right? Like I have to fix my microphone, I have to check audio settings, I have to think up topics, I have to. I mean, there's a lot of videos that I record that I don't end up putting up because they're just horrible. Like, there's there's probably in a in a given recording session, um, I would say maybe two or three episodes at least that uh, that get just yeeted into existence or out of existence rather, just because of um, there's bad. You know, like if I die like a minute in or. Um, like I just got distracted and forgot to commentate, which happens probably far more often than it should. 
Um, then I have to, uh, to re like re-record that one, and it's just there's a number of things that could uh, result in me having to do a re-recording, and uh, so it's 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 deceptively long. I mean, even assuming that the episodes are 15 minutes long, that's you know I have to pick a map, um, and do all that kind of stuff. So it's 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 a very it's a very time consuming. It's probably like four or five episodes a week to record. Especially now that I'm going up to hell on earth. And then on top of that, I'm recording two extra episodes today, and one of them is endless. So it's, it's going to be a, a long day for me. It's going to be a lot of Killing Floor 2 today. And the other thing is I can't really take a break either. Because I'm moving it to Mondays. So I don't have a backlog. Like, the last video that I have in the backlog goes up in... What time is it? Two? In six hours. So the next episode... The last episode that I just recorded, the first episode of this week, the first episode of this recording session, the one where my microphone kept breaking, that video goes up in like 18 hours. I have to, I have like five hours of, of recording and then probably another like hour and a half of, um, whatchamacallit, the, uh, the uploading, maybe an hour and a half, two hours to upload all of the videos before I can actually go in and start making thumbnails and all that, and then I have to make the thumbnails for them all, that's gonna take probably about another hour and a half. So we're sitting at about eight, nine hours of, of work. I have 18 hours, and I wanna sleep at some point too, right? So I don't, breaks, I wanna sleep, I wanna make lunch, dinner, you know? I mean, I had lunch, but I don't make dinner. I wanna eat dinner. You know, I'm gonna be hungry later. I can do that while it's uploading though, so I don't really have to count it, but it's uh, it's gonna be a, a day of a lot of YouTube stuff. But that's that's the price I pay. Normally, if I uh, if I had a day like this, I just put off some of the videos until Monday. Anyway, and that's why I like to record two days before the end of uh, the week, right? Like why I want to record Sunday when the last video goes up on Monday, or Monday when the last video goes up on Tuesday. Um, there's no way we can defend that. Not in a husk wave. Absolutely not. Just no chance. Absolutely no chance. Completely open up there. Um, yeah, so I want to record it, but like when I'm moving it over to, to Mondays now, I have to I have to suffer through it. It's gonna be better going forward though, because I mean I can uh, I can record a little bit more freely. I don't have to worry about people making noise. But I would normally just uh, record like half of them today and then half of them tomorrow. I also slept in a bit, so like I woke up at. 12-ish today. I stayed up late last night. I was playing um, Code Golf with uh, let's do some Code Golf with uh, a couple of members from the chat. I'm in. We're trying to get a, a formula or a, for, a function that would take uh, a number, so like 560 or something, and then figure out how many <clears throat> how many 50s and 20s need to be added up to make up that number. So with 560, it's uh, 1050s and 320s. With 550, it would be 1150s and 020s. So uh, a formula in the fewest number of characters that um, would be able to, to spit out those numbers. I got to, I think, 45? Yeah, I got to 45. Um, somebody else got to, I believe, 44 or 43 or something like that. I think he's actually at 34 now. I'm not sure. Anyway, I was playing that until I was doing that until maybe 4 a.m. last night. Like I did like five hours of this. It's so much fun because it's it's so dumb, really, too, right? Because you just you get rid of one character and you get so excited about it. Is this another one of those stupid objectives where stuff doesn't spawn? I think it is. Might be. What's going on here, buddy? So it's so silly because you get so excited about just one character that's going away. Like you get rid of a, a zero somewhere and you're like, oh, yes. <laughs> but it's fun. It's good fun. I enjoy it. But I slept in until about 12 o'clock today because I stayed up till 4 a.m. last night. 
And, uh... So I've, I've already wasted a bit of time today. That I could have used. Being more productive. Or at least giving myself a bit of a break. But, I mean, I made the commitment and I'll have to stick to it, right? I don't know how long we're going to be able to go today on the Endless. I guess I could put off some of the recording until tomorrow though, right? Like I get four episodes done and then I'll just have episodes for tomorrow. But the thing is that I like going through making all the thumbnails at once. Oh, that reminds me, I'm going to have to get a picture for Desolation. I wonder where I'm going to put the picture for Desolation. Let's keep an eye out for that while we're uh, running around here. Hopefully we can beat this boss. Hopefully it's like, I don't know, Abomination or something. I'll probably put it outside with the helicopter. I think I have um, a helicopter already as one of the pictures. I think for the mountain pass, Zed fix is the helicopter on the top of that mountain. Yeah, it's a half an hour in and the microphone is still fine. I think it was the Logitech thing. I think that's actually what the problem was. That's bizarre. I mean, not really, I understand it, but... Nice. I wish that was a functional button. Where's the KFP? Let's get a bit more distance because I think he's going to come up from down here. And we're going to use the Deagles for this guy because we've been using uh, the Glocks a little bit too much, I think. They're good, but... I mean, you want, you want some variety, right? What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing, buddy? Deagles are a little bit more powerful, though. I mean, then the, you know, if you're really good with the dual Glocks, then, um, then, uh, I don't want to be here, because I can't crouch to get away from your stinking laser. Uh, the dual Glocks, if you're really good at the, the accuracy with them, then they're probably better than the Deagles. But... Being accurate with dual Glocks is super hard, and then you can't hold the dual Deagles with them, so I think that it's just the worst setup. I think this is the best Gunslinger setup now. Single Glock, dual Deagles. I think that's about as good as it gets. But alright, there's that, uh, that one done. That's nice, that's nice. What else do we have? We have, um, I believe just the $75,000, so we'll see if we can't get that. I don't know how much money we're at now, but $75,000 should be like wave 80, I think. So, uh, if we're going to do it all in this this single run, then uh, it's going to it's gonna take quite a while. I don't think we're going to do it. If I do, then I'm definitely putting the rest of these videos off until tomorrow. I just... I can't record that much in one day. I'm tired, too, is the other thing, right? I mean, I'm perpetually tired these days. COVID's just really bringing me down. Get out of here, buddy. It's like my, 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 my entire state of existence these days is just tired. I don't think I'm depressed. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure I'm not. But I am just, like, perpetually tired. I get enough sleep. Um... I think I'm going to start working out more, though. Maybe that'll help kind of revitalize some of this this energy. I go for uh, short walks every day, but maybe maybe actually working out and, like, doing something like that would, uh, would help. I kind of want to get into working out in general, just because it would be good for uh, the weight loss, but... Yeah, so I, just, I don't know what I'm doing is the, is the main thing. I mean, how do you work out? I could go to the gym. I was going to go to the gym, actually, before COVID happened. I was planning on getting a gym membership, and then, uh, you know, I think they might be reopening, or they are reopened, um, but I'm not I'm not comfortable going to a gym. That seems like a, a terrible idea. So I was planning on going to the gym, but can't really do that now, or at least don't want to.
know what this stuff is. Okay, that was a good run. I don't know how long it broke. I don't know how long ago it broke, but that was a good run. We did get like 35 minutes before it broke. Um, wasn't the Logitech G Hub then? Although it did help. I'm not sure what else I can get rid of. We can't pick this up, right? Yeah, we're at we're at pretty much full capacity. I guess we can pick up uh, one other thing, but I don't really want to, cause it gets in the way of me being able to switch to my Glock. It'd be another two. And I don't have I don't have hotkeys to go to like the first two and the second two and whatnot. I do for these. I can hit five for the third, six or five for the second primary, six for the third primary, one for the first primary. I've got I've got hotkeys for all of that. Okay. Um one more one more cutout and I'm just gonna end the video. And I'm going to have to find something else to maybe fix this, because this is extremely frustrating. Oh, I thought I was good. I thought I had it when it was just working for, for so long. You know? We had a half an hour streak there, and it was, it was going great. And now it's just not going so great anymore. So we'll, we'll see how long it works, but the next time it cuts out, I am uh, I'm going to bring it back. And we are going to end the video there. Because this is just unbelievably frustrating. So, so, so frustrating. I don't think I can even accurately describe how frustrating it is. Because it's just... I mean, I'm sure for you guys too, it's, it's annoying for my audio to keep cutting out. But for me, it's like... Every time it happens, I have to go and like reset up my whole microphone setup and like unplug it, replug it, get it all moved around and all this kind of garbage. I mean, it's it's a it's a really not so super fun thing to be doing. To be honest with you. Hello, this is a lot of flesh pounds. Oh my goodness. We might end up dying here anyway. Just because I'm getting a little bit overwhelmed. No, nope, we're not going to die. We are not going to die here. We're good. Yeah, I cut out again. So we are going to end the video here. We're going to go die, see how much of all this different stuff we get. And then uh, we're going to have to end the video there. Because I'm really, really just frustrated. This sucks. This really, really sucks. It sucks probably more than uh, than I think you could ever know. Really, really frustrating. I have no idea how to fix it. No idea. I'm all out of ideas. I am all out of ideas. I have to do something though, right? I have to fix it somehow for the next episode. And going forward, I mean, the other thing is that I can't even test it until I record it. And then, you know, I'm like halfway into an episode and it breaks and it's... Ugh. Yeah, this sucks, man. This really, really sucks. Anyway, like the video, subscribe, comment. I'll see you next time. I really hope I can get this fixed. Bye-bye.